How goes it? I'm Wills Maxwell Jr. and this is What Did We Miss? Here I tell you the stories WWAY did not. Not all the stories, but enough to make you appreciate the ones they do. A Tennessee man facing drug possession charges decided his court appearance was a good time to light a joint. This complicated matters and also simplified them. It's a bold legal strategy to go, Your Honor, in my defense, I'm guilty. Before lighting up, Spencer Allen Boston asked to approach the bench and then gave a speech on how marijuana should be legalized. That's how stoned this guy was. He thought his speech worked already. Um, so in conclusion, ask not what you can do for your bud, but what can bud do for you? Thank you. What? It's legal now. I did it. Boston was taken into custody and charged with disorderly conduct, simple possession, and bogarting. Derek Johnson of Minnesota has a pet duck with a peculiar talent. Meet the world's best and possibly only drumming duck. Johnson named the duck Ben Affleck, which tells you he loves Ben Affleck and forcing puns. Dude, there's easier celebrity names to duckify. Zach Galifiakis, Margot Webby, Bill Pullman. The drumming duck has quickly become a viral sensation. Johnson bought Afquack from a farm store when the duckling was only a day old. He says he deliberately raises it to be more like a social pet rather than a farm animal. Derek, cherish these days. I have zero kids, but I know enough about parenting to know that one day Ben is going to come to you and say he doesn't want to drum anymore. Then you'll have to spend an uncomfortably long phase being supportive by pretending he's good at guitar. If you're looking to buy property in the Bay Area for less than a half million dollars, I have great news for you. For the low price of $100,000, you can buy a San Francisco parking spot. Don't try to wait for this price to come down because real estate agent Bill Williams is already getting offers. This condo parking space is being rented by a resident right now for $300 a month, but the owner wants to sell it to someone outright. Other spaces in this garage have sold for $80,000 to $90,000. Folks, this is what it looks like when a city has nothing left to gentrify. San Francisco got rid of all the poor people and now they're knocking out all the rich but not obscenely so people. A 2017 traffic report found that San Franciscans spend an average of 83 hours a year trying to find a parking spot and an additional 90 hours a year complaining about how hard it is to find a parking spot. I'm Wills Maxwell Jr. and that's what we missed.